Welcome back to the three months of modal logic, a sequel to the 100 days of logic here with Carnades.org. Today we're going to be continuing with epistemic logic, looking at axiom 4.4 in Doxastic and epistemic logic. Now, axiom 4.4 is going to be even stronger than axiom 4.3. It's not going to be quite as strong as axiom 5, but it's still going to be pretty strong. So if you, like me, were skeptical of 4.2 and 4.3, you're going to be even more skeptical of 4.4. So basically what we're saying here is if P is the case, it's not the case that S believes that, it's not the case that S believes that P implies that S believes that P and P being the case implies that it's not the case that S knows that it's not the case that S knows that P implies that S knows that P. Basically, if P is the case, then if it's not the case that you believe that it's not the case that you believe that P, then you believe that P or imagine that P is true, then imagine that you don't know that you don't know that P. So you don't know whether or not you know P or not. According to this axiom, therefore, you know that P. Imagine that you lack the belief, I do not believe that the sun rises in the east. And it is the case that the sun rises in the east. Therefore, according to this axiom, you would believe that the sun rises in the east because you don't believe that you don't believe it. Right? Yet, there seems to be an important difference between lacking the belief that you don't believe something and actually believing it. Basically, 4.4 is claiming that anything which is true, which you don't know that you don't know, is something that, in fact, you do know. So objections here are going to be something along the lines of imagine that you do not know whether or not you know something or do not believe whether or not you believe something. This seems to mean that you're suspending judgment, but according to this axiom, so long as the P, the proposition, is true, you do in fact know or believe what you don't know that you don't know or don't believe that you don't believe. So basically, you're not able to suspend judgment on the not truth of true propositions. This axiom will fall prey to the objections, of course, from any of the previous axioms 4.2 or 4.3, or even to objection axiom 4. Up next, we're going to be looking at a big question for a lot of these axioms, the question of what is logical omniscience? Watch a new video every single day for three months here at Carnades.org and stay skeptical, everybody.